Hey everybody, I am not Jody Miller. I'm Larry Elder, radio host, TV host, best-selling author, also known as the Sage from South Central. Here's the deal. I am a huge News Busted fan, but for the last seven years, don't know how these guys have done it. They've managed to survive with the same standard definition camera, same microphone, same lighting. Come on, it's time for a high-tech upgrade to HD technology, high-definition technology. But we can't get there without you. Without your generous tax-deductible donations, hey, News Busted could go the way of the rotary phone, the floppy disk, the Betamax. You don't want that. Jody Miller deserves better, and so do you. Come on. Log on to hdnewsbusted.com. That's hdnewsbusted.com. And give, give, give until it feels good. <laughs> I'm Larry Elder. I'm Jody Miller. Let's get started. President Obama finally came up with a strategy to deal with ISIS. His plan is to draw two red lines, return five Gitmo prisoners, and then play 36 holes at a political fundraiser. <laughs> President Obama said ISIS must be destroyed, but then he said it can become a manageable problem. When asked if he's sending mixed messages, the president said yes and no. <laughs> New York Governor Andrew Cuomo told reporters that debates can be a disservice to democracy. Yes, Cuomo would much rather voters pick their candidate the old-fashioned way, by just voting for a familiar last name. <laughs> Former President Bill Clinton was in New Orleans Saturday campaigning for Senator Mary Landrieu. The two Democrats have a lot in common. For example, Clinton doesn't live in Louisiana either. <laughs> Vice President Joe Biden said America will follow ISIS to the gates of hell. Well, that's convenient, because thanks to Obama and Biden, America's already going to hell in a handbasket. <laughs> Detroit's historic Chapter 9 bankruptcy trial is underway. Detroit is so broke, the mayor is considering burning down City Hall for the insurance money. <laughs> And finally, hundreds of nude celebrity photos, including those of Kate Upton, Kirsten Dunst, and Jennifer Lawrence, have been leaked to the Internet. The good news? There are no nude photos of Hillary Clinton. <laughs> Thanks for watching News Lesson, everybody. I'm Jody Miller. Make sure to subscribe to our videos on YouTube. And we'll catch you next time.